Uh, today also marks 40 years since one of the greatest tragedies to hit the music world, the death of John Lennon. Michael George looks back at that day and the legacy Lennon leaves behind. Fans of John Lennon came together at the memorial in Central Park known as Strawberry Fields. One of the greatest artists, philosophers, humanitarians, and uh, and inspirations. Some of these fans were also right here on that tragic night 40 years ago when the Beatles legend was gunned down outside his apartment at the age of 40. Came here at night with uh, a big crowd of people and sang songs and cried. Very sad day I'll never forget. I was you know, driving along the road and, and a song came on and I just, it just hit me. And, and, and the tears started flowing and I started crying. Charles Rosnay is a Beatles expert who published a magazine about the band. He says Lennon was one of the most influential musicians of all time, but his death transcended music. What we lost that night was not the killing of one rock star. What we lost is somebody who till today would have probably given us great insight. Uh, he spoke the truth. He brought to light obvious things that, you know, the, the world and politicians should have seen. And even 40 years later, Living for today. John Lennon's legacy lives on. Fans like Mike Egan say his music and his message of peace are timeless. Just a legend, taken too soon, and um, it's just really amazing that we have this place to keep remembering him by. You may say I'm a dreamer. Still inspiring millions, a generation after he left us.